So really quickly, I want to talk about something in Bootstrap called Responsive Utility Classes. And these are pretty cool uh, classes that you can add on uh, different elements of your website. And it'll hide them and show them uh, depending on what, um, you know, what kind of device you're viewing on. So if I want to hide something on the desktop and uh, I only want it visible on the phone, I could just add this um, hidden desktop to the to any element and it'll hide it so let's say for example I wanted my accordion to be hidden on the desktop because I think it'll uh, you know it'll be something that'll look a lot much better on a on a mobile phone so let me switch back to my file and I'm gonna go to my accordion and I'm gonna add a class hidden desktop And I'll save that. Switch back to my browser and hit refresh. And as you can see, it's gone now. And when I resize my window, it'll come back up for a tablet view. And that's because I put only uh, the hidden, hidden desktop. I'll go all the way down to mobile. And uh, accordion is placed right here. And um, there's one example. If we take a look at our slider when it's at mobile, you can see it looks kind of, I don't know, kind of crunched or whatever. And I know we just have an image placeholder here, but let's say we had uh, an image that, like an actual image and we you know we resized all the way down to mobile and it turns out the image doesn't look uh, very good on a mobile device so we can deal with that by just hiding the slider all together and where is it at oh it's down here and we can have a class of hidden phone we'll save it We'll open the browser back up and I'll refresh it and it's gone now so if I resize the window again and go up to about tablet remember we haven't done anything with the uh, with tablet yet so everything's still gonna be there and when I go back to desktop my accordion's gone and my sliders back and it's still functional um, I'm going to switch back over to the uh, Bootstrap website really quick. And they have this nice table here that kind of breaks down um, each of the classes. And if you notice here, we use hidden phone and hidden desktop. And that means it just hides it from that particular window, but it still shows it on the other one. We could also use visible phone or tablet or desktop, and it'll show it only on that window. So. Let's make um, let's make our block quote. We'll give that a class of visible tablet, and hopefully it'll only show up um, when somebody's viewing from a tablet. So I'm gonna add a class equal to visible dash tablet, and save it. And I'll switch back over to my browser and I'm gonna refresh. And now it's gone. And if I go all the way down to mobile, it'll still be gone. And if I resize it up just to about a tablet size, there we go, it's back. So there's a there's a few examples on how to use the utility classes, and they can be really handy, um, especially when you have something that you just absolutely cannot fit onto a mobile screen or um, something that doesn't make sense on a desktop and that's gonna be the end of this or my whole lesson on bootstrap um, I didn't cover everything and I mentioned this in my last video but there's a lot of cool components and um, you know items that I didn't cover and that's because I didn't think they really made sense on a static web page so my next lesson or I guess next short series is gonna be about building a WordPress blog site and I'll use some of these things like breadcrumbs and pagination. And um, I look forward to building it. And I hope 
you look forward to watching them. And if you watched every video for this lesson, I want to thank you very much. And um, that's it. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe too.